Kurumai Small Hall in downtown Tokyo is the showcase of small wrestling, one of Japan's traditional sports. Small bouts are fought in a ring only four and a half meters in diameter. A bout is won or lost when one of the wrestlers throws the other or when one of them is pushed out of the ring. Today's sumo is still regarded as an art and is sometimes called the national sport of Japan. More than 10,000 spectators usually attend the 15-day national tournaments, which are held every other month. Sparks fly as these enormous wrestlers, averaging 180 centimeters in height and 120 kilos in weight, crash together. There are no weight categories and a comparatively small wrestler may be able to use superior technique to throw a much larger opponent. The real origin of Smo is shrouded in legend, but various written and verbal accounts of Smo history have been handed down to us. Professional wrestlers appeared around the 15th century and by the 17th century, the sport had become widely popular. With the appearance of such grand champions as Raiden, interest in Smo further increased and it became a form of public entertainment. This is a Smo stable. The wrestlers live together and practice. There are about 28 such stables in Tokyo, with approximately 800 wrestlers. About 50 men live in this stable, headed by the wrestling master. Until a young wrestler becomes a full-fledged small wrestler, he will rely on the wrestling master for all of his needs. A small wrestler's attire consists of a cloth sash called a mawashi. Small stables were founded so that famous retired wrestlers could advise and train younger men. Let's take a look at some of the training methods. This exercise is called tempo. It is a special small exercise designed to help a wrestler to charge powerfully and to increase the strength of his arms and wrists. This exercise is called matawari. It is designed to promote suppleness. In this charging practice, the wrestler uses his opponent's chest to push against. This promotes pushing power, which is the basis of small wrestling. It is said that the majority of young wrestlers who drop out of training do so because they are unable to stand the severity of this exercise. There are eight ranks in small and promotion depends on the number of matches a wrestler can win. If he loses too many matches, he is demoted and slips back down. Thus, constant practice is a must. Moshiai is a mock bout designed to improve a wrestler's techniques. There are 70 traditional techniques in Smo, and these are taught to the young wrestlers by the more senior men. Shiko is a limbering up exercise and a wrestler usually does it one or two thousand times after he has finished the rest of his practice. It is designed to strengthen the legs and the back. Training begins at 6 a.m. and continues until 10 a.m. Wrestlers generally eat just twice a day. They eat what is called chakanoba, a fish and vegetable stew with rice. A wrestler may eat nine or ten large bowls of this at a sitting. This rich stew helps wrestlers attain weights over twice that of the Japanese national average. 
After the meal, there is a brief period of rest when the wrestler has his hair arranged before leaving for the tournament. The hairdresser, who takes care of small wrestlers' hair, is called a tokoyama. The tokoyama binds the top knot tightly so that it will not come undone. The day before each tournament begins, an ancient custom called the ring ceremony is performed. The ring ceremony is a kind of purification rite. Officials from the Japan Sumo Association sit in a row, and Shinto prayers are recited and rites performed. Such offerings as rice, salt, and seaweed are placed in the ring. These represent a desire for abundant harvests and for the safety of the wrestlers. After the religious rites of the ring ceremony have been performed, two drums are carried separately into the hall and paraded three times around the ring. are then carried out into the town to announce that the small tournament will begin on the following day. Now, the opening day has finally arrived, and the curtain goes up on 15 days of heated competition. There are six annual tournaments held in Tokyo, Osaka, Nagoya, and Fukuoka. The shops of the Samo Service Company, which are in a corner of the Samo Hall, naturally do a brisk business. There are 20 shops there for selling tickets, showing the spectators to their seats, and providing them with drinks and box lunches. The ushers are kept constantly on the run, showing spectators to their seats. Many find the pageantry of Smo extremely impressive and exciting, and fans roar to encourage their favorite wrestlers. This is the ceremony called the Display of Wrestlers, a special characteristic of Smo. The senior wrestlers, clad in their gorgeous ornamental aprons, march into the ring from opposite sides. First, they offer a prayer for a good harvest, and then they pray to dedicate themselves to smoke. Next, the highest rank of small wrestlers, the grand champions, give their display. Besides the ornamental apron, a grand champion wears the champion's belt. He is preceded by his herald and followed by his sword bearer. He enters the ring majestically and gives his display to the applause of the packed hall. A large number of teenage boys, especially from farming and fishing villages, set out to be wrestlers, but only one in 600 overcomes all the barriers and rises to the height of grand champion. Fifteenth day of the tournament, the wrestlers from the last three bouts form into two groups, east and west, and perform the ceremony of 
stamping in unison. Let's meet some of the other people, essential to the sport of smoke. In the ring, the caller raises his voice to summon the wrestlers. Immediately below the ring sit the eagle-eyed judges, whose job it is to check the referee's decisions. The referee is responsible for conducting the bout. The fans and the wrestlers never dispute his word. Before a bout, the wrestler purifies his body by wiping himself and accepts a drink of water from the winner of the previous bout. Then he throws salt in a traditional custom of purifying the ring. Wrestlers in the most advanced division are allowed four minutes warming up time before a bout. This lets them size up their opponents and is also a time of subtle psychological warfare as they eye each other. A match is about to commence between two champions. Their slow movements are full of strength and fierce determination. Each is waiting to see what kind of move the other will make. These banners advertise the fact that companies and stores have put up prize money. NHK, Japan Broadcasting Corporation, reporters bring a minute-by-minute -minute account of the exciting contests to small fans throughout the country by means of radio and to television. crowd is in an uproar because of the upset defeat of the grand champion by the lower ranking wrestler. Now comes the climax. This is the bout that will decide the result of the entire tournament. junior champion wins the tournament. After all the contests are over, an ancient ceremony is performed with a bow, and the curtain comes down on 15 exciting days of smoke. The crowd roars its approval as Captain Naomi, the winner of the tournament, receives Smo's highest honor, the Emperor's Cup. This is the moment that makes all his hardships worthwhile. The victor is also honored with other trophies, including the NHK Cup. But tomorrow, begins the long grind of practicing for the next tournament in the traditional sport of smoke.